Hi, this is Ryan with Presentation Geeks. Today we're going to talk about how to insert an image as a circle into Prezi. Most people know how to put an image in pretty easily and by nature most images that you're inserting are in a square or rectangular shape. So for example I'm going to select a file here, I'm going to use one of our directors here. This is Justin from Presentation Geeks and if I want to include this image in my presentation it looks nice but it definitely has that rectangular shape. The best I can do I can crop it and I can change it a little bit but I'm still stuck with those hard edges and the four, uh, the four sides. So I want to talk about how you can actually make this a circle which is a nice look that a lot of people don't know how to do. Now the one caveat here is that you do have to use a different piece of software. Prezi inherently cannot do it. Um, I'm going to do it with Photoshop but there's a lot of online resources for free that you can also do it with. So it's quite simple. I'm going to open up that same image in Photoshop here and I'm just going to choose a selection tool in, uh, in Photoshop. I'm going to use the elliptical marquee and I'm just going to drag a circle around Justin's head here. If I hold down the shift I get a perfect circle and I can kind of get it exactly where I want it. When I've got it and I'm happy with it, I'm just going to let it go. That creates a nice selection in the shape of the circle which is what I want. From here I'm going to go to Edit, Copy and then I'm going to make a new document. File, New, Photoshop will automatically make it the perfect size for me and now I can go edit, paste. Now if you've used these programs before you know there's lots of other ways to do it but this is a nice simple way. Now I still have that white in the background so what I have to do, if you look over here in your layers, I have to turn off that background layer. So I'm just going to click the little eyeball so now it disappears. And in most image editing software if you see this little grid of grey and white squares that means transparency. So right now this is a circle with transparency behind it. From here I need to resave this and this is where people sometimes get messed up. When you go to save you get to choose what type of file. Well it's really important that you use something that supports transparency. In this case we are going to use a PNG. And this is a type of file that Prezi loves so we're going to save it as a PNG. I'll call this Justin Circle. I'm going to hit save. Just click OK on these little options. They won't make a difference for you. And now when I go back out to my Prezi here, if I choose to select files, I now have Justin Circle. And when I insert that, I have this really nice image where he's locked away in a circle. And the average person isn't able to do this in Prezi so this is something you can use to help make your presentation stand out.